We went into the kitchen. She grabbed a knife and we called 911. Lynn Sarver says this January 1st morning is not how she expected to start the new year. My alarm went off at 5.15 in the morning and um, I woke up and saw somebody laying in the dog's bed with him. That dog, Benton, a 120 pound mastiff. <laughs> Sarver says she and her roommate fell asleep on the couch, feet from the stranger. His shoes placed by the bed, his money and wallet there too. He also left his hat. Confusion and panic set in. I couldn't see his face and I, you know, I could only see the top of his head. The women waited for police who came and woke the man up. Turns out he's a 24 year old who lives two doors down. He told us he was drinking at a Waukesha bar. Someone dropped him off, but instead of going to his house, he crashed here and he doesn't remember anything after midnight. How did he get in? To be honest, I don't know if my door was locked or not. Fortunately for the man, Benton is an easygoing dog. He just laid on top of him. Are you questioning his skills as a guard dog? I'm actually not because they're, these dogs are known to um, let somebody in the house and not let them out. It just happened that he was a very nice young kid who made a huge mistake, but they said, yeah, this could have been a lot worse. The man apologized a number of times to Lynn. She is not pressing charges, but she will be making sure to lock her doors every night. Kristen Byrne, today's TMJ4.